Welcome to the Maths Made Easy tutorial on long division. So uh, we're going to be covering the bus stop method in this video. So the bus stop method is a method of long division. So uh, in this example we have calculate 288 divided by 9. So the first thing we do is set up the bus stop. So it's called the bus stop method because it looks like a bus stop. Then we put the divisor, so that's the number that we're dividing by, inside the bus stop. So in this case 288. And then the other number we'll put outside. So the first thing we do uh, is we look at how many times does 9 go into 2. Uh, the answer is 0, uh, so we leave the top bit blank for now, and then we carry the 2 across to the 8. And then we look at how many times does 9 go into 28. Well, the answer is 3, because 3 times 9 is 27. So that leaves us with 3 on the top, and we have a remainder of 1, uh, because 28 minus 27 is 1 and that remainder uh, we put in the next number so we make the 8 into an 18 uh, and then we have how many times does 9 go into 18 the answer is 2 2 times 9 is 18 so our final answer therefore is 32 uh, so 288 divided by 9 is 32 what about if we have a long division with a remainder so for instance 67 divided by 5 once again we set up the bus stop so we put 67 inside and 5 on the outside. So how many times does 5 go into 6, first of all? The answer is once, and we have a remainder of 1. So uh, we put the remainder here. So we've got uh, how many times does 5 go into 17 now? And the answer is 3. Uh, and then this time, the remainder we put back on the top. So uh, 3 times 5 is 15, so the remainder is 2. So we can write R2 on the top. So the answer then, uh, 67 divided by 5, is equal to 13 remainder 2. Now long division is certainly a skill that takes some practice, so you can do so with our online exam. It's available through our revision platform, and if you take the test you'll find loads of different questions to have a go at. So it's all good practice for your exam, and you get instant feedback on everything, so uh, it's a really good way of keeping track of your progress and finding out where you need to improve. Uh, so if you're interested, then you can click the link below and I'll take you straight there.